Hello friends, this is Jawad Nagda from Fenrison Management Consulting and today I'm going to talk about one of my favorite Power Query tip related to creating dynamic calendar table. Now most of you who have been in touch with Power Query and Power Excel would already know how important a calendar lookup table is, but how you can create a dynamic rolling calendar lookup table is the subject of our discussion today. So we will go into data tab, into get and transform data, get data, other sources, and blank query. Next up, we will add an opening date. And let's say in this case, I want this to be 2019, one January, enter. Next step is going to be in step, step after. And here we are going to write a little M code that will help us achieve what we are trying to achieve. This dot date, source, number dot from, date time, local now function that gives us the current um, date. And then we subtract from opening date that we have just provided earlier. And now we are just going to define the duration to the step, which is one day at a time. And that's about it. Press enter, and there we go. We get the rolling list of calendar dates, and it will end up until the end of uh, the 27th of February as I'm recording this video. And there you go, you can see it. So now it is still in the form of a list. The first thing first, we're gonna convert this into a table. Press OK. Name this table after calendar lookup, something like that. And change the format of the column into date. You can name, name this after date. And now we can create a completely robust dynamic calendar lookup table by adding all the necessary fields that we wanna add. The one thing that I wanna show you is Start of week. The week of uh, the start of week is, so as you can see right now, Microsoft Excel is treating the first day of the week to be Sunday. And if I want to change this to Monday, because that is what is operational in my company, all I need to do is enter a comma here and then type one to shift the date by one day and press enter. And as you can see, the start of week has now shifted from 6 January to 7 January. And the rest of the drill, you would already know, we can add all those things, months, quarter, day of the week, day of the month, day of the year, name of day, and so forth. Hopefully you like it. More coming up soon. Thank you.